Hello everyone. Uh, just thought I should get right, right into the game without having to stay at the home menu again. Um, so yeah, last time we left off, I still sitting in the darkness, and I need to get rid of some stuff. But um, I looked into while I was off, not doing much. Went to look more into the um. Like in, 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 into into the game, and, and I and I and I drove and dove into the forums a little bit and stuff like that, and looked around to see what I could find over there, and to me some more information and new stuff. Uh, one of the things, obviously, I have not really taken into account is that yes, my food is probably going to start to rot at some point. I kind of realized that. Kind of fault. Not my fault, but it's all right. And one of the other things, too, is that one of the things that the developers that I read in their roadmaps that they really want, like the ideas of what they want to do and stuff like that with this game, is to make the game challenging, for one, and I agree with that. Like, right now, I'm okay, but from what I've heard and seen from other people who have played the play this game and stuff like that for a, good, a lot more portion and then lasted over a hundred days and stuff like that completely fine with no it with it with no issues or anything I personally think that it's just that's a little bit that's cool but at the same time I think that is overpowered that you know you can do that um, personally I'd rather not try to push towards creating like this you know, like make it very easy for myself. Obviously, that's the point to make it easy for myself so I can explore and do more and stuff like that. But it gets to the point where it might be too much. So I'm gonna not try it to do that. I'm gonna try to keep it as simple as I can. Well, simple as in. I should just wait to put that down. Simple as in, like. Try not to make it too easy, you know? I think that'd be a good idea. Is to, you know, keep it at least still enjoyable in, in any way I can. Um, but, anyway, enough of my rambling. Uh, let's, try, let's get rid of some of this stuff. I could probably use this one as Pigman, but I wouldn't want to pick King, but I haven't found the problem, so... I really don't think that's really worth it, in all honesty. Um, though I do need to find them, though. I cannot deny that. Cool. Uh, this is what I saw last time was a log suit. I'm being really stingy in what I want, but there's no reason for me to feel good about it. I need the stuff. Can't get around it. I can I can get more. I can get more of this stuff over in the graves and stuff. At least I know where they are. So, so that means I'm gonna plant a couple more trees. Please don't drop it. So, my goal, um, is to, obviously, try to make this base a little bit more. Because it doesn't seem like the monsters spawn on the road up here. What I did see, though, that I didn't know before, is that if you have your shovel, you can actually dig up these areas as well, like the roads and stuff, and you can, uh, pretty much make it a, pretty much exactly what you want it to be. So I think that's kind of cool. But, um, uh, I'm gonna go get supplies. I guess. That's probably the best thing I can do right now is find some supplies. All these bushes probably have already come back as well, but uh, I have so many. I might as well, like, if I, I, I really need to find some, uh, pig area. 
if I can get some manure and stuff like that, that probably would be a better idea. So, where do we have? We haven't checked this bottom area yet. So let's go down there. Maybe, maybe we'll be able to find something. But like I said, I kind of don't even want any more food. I don't. That's probably not even a good idea to get more. For the simple fact that it's probably going to spoil at some point. So I have to. I really have to keep an eye on that. Yeah, it's not a huge challenge, but to me, I feel like it is because I'll probably easily forget that I have food just sitting here, so I'm probably going to leave whatever push over there. I'll go back there next time. My fire went out too there. There, too few. But yeah, this is so this is where my base is gonna be then. Simple like I said, so I can get over onto this side, get some stone, stuff like that, try to be a little bit thoughtful in what I'm doing here. I what I wanna make though I wanna make a box. No, I haven't bought it, have I? Yes I have, but I need rope. And I can make rope. Awesome. And yeah, why not? Yeah, I was just so from what I know. Yeah, I was gonna say I can't carry my backpack with me. So because there's so much stuff in there. So I'm assuming I'm just gonna have to keep the log suit on me, which is fine. I really don't mind that. But might as well start eating all the food that I can. Because uh, one of the things that they did add up though is that they lowered the health regen, if I'm correct, and they did higher up the uh, hunger though. So starving isn't as bad, but obviously the spoiling food is still gonna always be a problem. Um, I need more wood though. It's probably the big thing I'm gonna need though. Is more wood. This is what I this is what I was looking at last time. That gave me the ability to spawn back if I happen to die for some reason. So I need cooked meat, beard hair, and some boards. So that's cool. Um, newer. Gotta, gotta get some of that. Trap I don't really need. Bug trap I might, but I need some silk for that. Shit on so. Um, some of the stuff I don't want, really want to um, build at the moment, because I don't necessarily need it currently. this down. That would be good. Take that nature. Um, so let's get a little bit of that. Like I said, I'm not going to worry about food. I'm priority right now. I want to keep some of the trees here alive. But we need to find pig. Pig meat. Where? I don't know. Hopefully we'll find some soon. Find some of them roaming around somewhere. At least I know this place is full of food. Oh. Oh. I, I wasn't sure what was going on there for a second. Okay, I'm not, I'm not finding much. It's a... Big area?
A lot of exploring, but nothing to see. Where the pigs? Give me the pigs. Not the birds, the pigs. Yeah, no, there really is a lot of food around here. So that's good. I just have to worry about my actual survival back in my base. But I really do need to find pigs though, because I need them in the so I can start growing some food. I also heard that honey is also a very good source that I should try to look into, which doesn't sound like a bad idea either. Tons of graves. I found a lot of food. A lot of screeching rabbits. But still no pigs. It's starting to be a little disheartening. I really would like to find some. It'd be, it'd be a lot of help. And then I can start giving them my food as well. So I can have some of them come back with me, but it would seem. My efforts are not being paid well. Yeah, cause I think they're gonna be like more, let's say like over here and stuff like that, because it looks more like a graveyard area over here. Um, I mean, there's probably more up here and stuff like that, but I'm not finding much down here. Besides, obviously, more stuff. This is probably the boring part of exploring. Probably just walking around, not knowing where you're going. Exploring, not knowing. But we will find what we're looking for, hopefully, one day. My timer's going down, and I'm pretty far away. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna risk not going back, because I have food. So I'm gonna risk just keep going forward, and try to find some stuff. Just doing that. Because I'm too far away. End of the world? Okay. That's not good. Alright. That means our only way is going up. And there's a graveyard. And there's a honey. Keep walking. Maybe we'll find something. Unless we're gonna find more water. Which I don't want. Yep, more water. Good. Spiders. Okay, I don't want to be near that right now. Sun's going down. Maybe I will make it back home. Oh man. I really am on an island, aren't I? Oh no. Alright, so. It seems there's nothing on this island. So. Type turkey. Um, oh, are, oh, these are the turkeys that I've had before. I don't want to kill them, though, actually, because I don't have food. Hmm. Let me just make it back. Whatever. I thought I was gonna... I thought I, I thought I had a lot more time to get back. One of the... Also, the one of the other cool features that uh, they apparently are going to be adding as well is winter. I'm rather excited to hear about this, because it will make... Um, you have to worry about your, um, heat, stay warm so you don't freeze to death, as well as they're also adding, uh, sanity. So that's also pretty interesting. So, now uh, you can go insane in the woods by yourself. You don't start talking to yourself, you know. It's weird, really weird and bad stuff going on, you know. Things you wish you never told anyone when you got back. After a long voyage of being, um, being lost or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about, sorry. Huh. Um, hmm. I 
heard though if you put food in a chest that it actually spoils the food. I know I know there's a refrigerator that you can put it in. Icebox, yeah. It slows the food spoilage, yeah. But man, I really noticed. I really do run out of uh run out of wood quickly. That's good. Mm. What else do I need to make? I don't want to make a chest, there's no reason for that. I actually don't like have too much. I should make that. Yeah, why not? a lot more useful. Ooh, hello, stale. Ooh, that's... Oh, oh! Oh, that's what it means by that, by the green. No, that's not for easy highlighting. Oh. Okay, well, apparently roasting them will help. So I better just do that. Don't waste the whole thing. Well, now I understand... Um, not, now I understand uh, what the green means. It pretty much means the held off. I thought it was just a highlight for a second. But now I understand that's for the staleness of it and stuff like that. Okay, that makes sense. Hmm. That means the rest... Oh, that means the seeds aren't gonna rot or spoil. Neither are the carrots, apparently. So berries are probably gonna be the worst thing we're probably gonna have to keep an eye on. If we get any more. If we do. Because I actually have to bring some over here and stuff like that, but... That figures right when I do. Okay, well. Nothing else to do here, so... I'll have to explore more. Maybe I can try to attack some things, maybe. But our first goal... is... we're gonna walk straight. We're gonna walk straight through this. And we're gonna go... Like I said, we're gonna try to find some pigs. That's our main priority here. Apparently, I'm going to have company here in a little bit. So, let's hurry up. I might have to end this a little early for you guys. My apologies for that. Uh, hope you don't mind. But, like I said, let's try to, try to look real quick before... Ooh. Don't get near me. I don't need to die by you again. Right. I'm going to... I'm going to follow that road. To where the road ends. Or the sidewalk ends. That's still a good it's still that's still a good book. I always love that book. And I when I read that as a child, it didn't it seemed so you know, hard at the time, but I hope this doesn't like end. Man. This is just like creepy. Where are we going? Ooh. Uh, completely dead. It's completely dead over here. He found the road though. Maybe it'll lead me somewhere. Or just lead me to my death. Oh, it's always one of the two. Going in a circle, going in a circle. Spider spiders, but no. I don't have any pigs to Good lord, where are they? Yeah. Okay, it looks like I'm gonna have to stop here for now, guys. Uh, my apologies. Uh, thank you for watching. Very, uh, thank you. Bleh, I'm so sorry. Thank you for watching, and uh, I will get back on this immediately as soon as I can so I can survive and stuff. So, thank you very much, and goodbye.